the spotlight I can see you Play your cards right Kill your stage fright This could be you You're a minor part I'm the major star Ha! The credits are more than just the air Hollywood actor John Juniper <laughs> oh, I'm such a fan That's John Juniper in the flesh. Oh, Agent, I am. Well, I'm sure you can handle things from here. Good evening, everyone. Now, I know what you're thinking. John, these tickets cost more than my yacht. This better be good. <laughs> I also want to take the opportunity to make a special announcement. I've got something new in production. I can't say too much yet, but I can safely say that you've never seen anything like it. For tonight, though, let's move on to the main event. What on earth are you doing? You've ruined everything. Zaraxxus team, the time for subtlety has passed. This is not part of the show. Everybody run. John Juniper here. No, I can't. I left for Europe this morning. How about this? I've got an autonomous jet at JFK. Oh, were you on a different call? Sorry about that. Unregistered signals tend to cut out at these altitudes. I can keep you company till you get here, though. Let's see. I can have my man Gibson pick you up in four hours. Passenger identification failed. Initiating elimination protocol. I can't believe this. My flight staff forgot to shut off the security system. I am so sorry. I'll need to have a word with them. Bad news. I can't shut off the lasers from here. You're a spy, though, so you can just disarm them or something, right? Like, whenever I play a spy, that's the sort of thing I do. See? Look at you. You didn't need my help anyway. <laughs> I'd really appreciate it if you'd put that back. It's fragile. Custom made. the mask you bugged to a castle in the Alps. If Juniper's there, the briefcase must be too. You need to find it and get it out of there. Hey, you. Tell Gibson to send that bottle I've been saving to the ballroom. the 
briefcase. Hey, uh, Gibson, do you see any intruders on that map of yours? Didn't think so. This is all very clever, Agent, but your little game ends here. Door's locked. And barred. Can't get in there. What are you waiting for, then? Turn on the gas! Huh, it was working earlier. I think the tank's empty. What? How did... The map... The agent's right there! Are, are you wearing one of my masks? You, shoot the agent now! Toss the grenade, then you shut the hatch! Honestly, how did any of you survive hostility training? All the work I've done for decades! This is really nothing to you! It's nothing personal. Nothing <laughs> personal? I'll give you nothing personal. Agent Phoenix, the heads of state are still alive. Then be quiet. Make me, you puffed up self-important reprobate. How dare you, you insufferable two-bit weasel! Yes, a way out! Come back to the van, quickly! Nothing important in there, I'm sure. Cut. That was perfect. About time, too. Oh, don't get any ideas. You're not going anywhere. As a matter of fact, you and I are going to have a little chat. Agent, up here. Remember this? We need to get that briefcase to agency headquarters. Not a bad impression of your handler, eh? I didn't win all those awards for nothing. Hey, you know what? I've never gotten to do a classic villain monologue before. And what do I have here but a captive audience? <laughs> Dr. Zor promised me the role of a lifetime. Xeraxis needed the world's greatest actor. So I delivered. Who but John Juniper could have impersonated every head of state, fooling the whole world into thinking they joined Xeraxis. Hollywood just can't compete. I've never had a bigger spotlight. And then there's you, Agent Phoenix back from the dead. An extra trying to upstage the star. <laughs> oh, your performance back in the wine cellar almost had me fooled. Almost. Don't worry, though. I've got all the nuclear codes right here. So it's time for my final scene. Zoraxis defense. The peace summit the big reveal. <laughs> oh, cheer up. We're not going to destroy the world or anything. We're just going to set off a few nukes to make sure they know who's in charge now. Sadly, that makes this your final scene, too. If it were up to me, I'd just shoot you. But Zor was insistent on getting some footage of the Phoenix. Don't ask me why. If things had gone according to plan, you'd have been dead before you were halfway across the Atlantic. Well, fine, I've got the kidnapping thing down, we've got this set for the heads of state, and I do have a knack for direction. I don't expect you to understand. I expect you to... Well, <laughs> frankly, I expect you to find a way out. But you'll be too late. Wow, you just sat there and listened to the whole thing. I honestly didn't think that would happen. In any case, I'm on a bit of a tight schedule right now. Peace Summit starts in a couple hours, and I'm not going to miss my cue. Zor's just going to have to work with what we've got. Lights! Camera! And... Action! Motion detected. Couldn't resist. You and I are going to have a little chat. Agent, up here. Remember this? We need to get that briefcase to agency headquarters. Not a bad impression of your handler, eh? I didn't win all those awards for nothing. 
Hey, you know what? Oh, you wanna skip to the part where you die? Fine. Lights! Camera! And... Action! Motion detected. We know where Juniper's right. taking the briefcase. The headquarters of Zorax's defense is on an island in the middle of the Black Sea. Fortunately for you, I'm afraid that this is a piece. And I'm not the premier. Courtesy of yours truly, the world's greatest actor. The world's governments are, as of this moment, under new management. Ha! You look like you don't believe me. Well, let me make it easier for you. Your previous heads of state have very generous handed over their nuclear codes. So I'm gonna launch a couple nukes, just to show you we're serious. What? Sorry, folks. I need to deal with some technical difficulties. Sorry, folks. I need to deal with some technical difficulties. Right, like I'm gonna let that happen. Wait, 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 Agent. Let's not be too hasty. You don't want me, you want Zor. I can tell you who Dr. Zor is. No, no Mr. Juniper. Juniper. I, don't I don't think, think so. so. Ha! What are you gonna do about it? There's nobody left in this building to stop me. I'm still running the show. Mr. Juniper, you were never running the show. Fabricator, if you would. Bye-bye, John. What? Wait! Doctor, I... Ah! What a disappointment. Your move, Agent.